Hey guys, it's Ray from Article 12 and EpicDroid.com, and I'm here today with a super quick video showing you guys how to install APK files that include an OBB file on Android 14. Now this process used to be a lot simpler. It used to be that you could just use your phone and you could use your favorite file explorer in order to be able to do it. Unfortunately, they have changed the process to where now your OBB folder in your favorite file browsers, actually across the board in all file browsers, is now blocked. You can still get access to it if you have root, but if you don't have root, you'll go in there and you'll go into your Android and you'll go into OBB and go into any of those folders and you automatically get this little message here. After you press OK, the Android document selection dialog will be displayed. Please press use this folder. When you do that, it just tells you it can't use this folder and you'll see a variation of that message across every file browser. Unfortunately, without root access, there's no way around that just using your device by itself. However, I have found that there is a method that you can use using your computer with your device. So I'm gonna use Magic the Gathering Arena to show you guys how this process works. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to my website, rwoko12.com, I'm gonna download the APK file, and then I'm gonna download the OBB file. Once those are both finished downloading, we'll be able to show you guys how this process works. All right, so now that the download's complete, we're gonna do two things. First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna install the APK file. And once it installs the APK file, we're gonna hit open. Now, if you're on Arena, it's gonna give you this installation failed message. That's because it's missing the components or the OBB file that it needs to finish the installation. We're not gonna do anything here except for hit close. And then we're going to take our phone and we're going to plug it into our computer. And then you're going to swipe down and then you're gonna hit charging this device via USB. You're gonna hit tap for more options and you're gonna hit file transfer. Then we're gonna move over here to our computer. You may get a message asking you what you wanna do with your device. I've already hit that on mine so my system remembers it, but I'm gonna go to my internal shared storage. I'm gonna to go to my download folder. I'm going to grab that OBB file. I'm gonna hit control copy. And we're gonna go back to the internal shared storage, go to Android, go to OBB. And in here, you'll find that it's created a folder that typically has a file name that is specific to the app that you're installing. In this case, it's going to be com.wizards.mtga. I'm going to double click, then you're going to paste. Once it's finished moving that file, you can go ahead and you can unplug your device. I'm going to unlock it, and then you are good to go. In this particular case, Arena is gonna to have to download some additional files because it was uninstalled before, so it has some stuff it needs to download to get it up to date and download all the additional cards and things like that. But your mileage may vary depending on which app you're installing. But that's an easy way that you can work around those Android 14 restrictions that prevent you from being able to do it directly on your device. If you guys have any questions about this process or about anything else you've seen in this video, please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section down below and we'll apply as soon as we're available. If you've enjoyed this video and if you want to see more like it, please remember to give us a thumbs up and to share it with your friends. And as always, just want to tell you guys thank you for watching, thank you for all your support, and you all have an awesome day.